What's up guys welcome to my channel and in today's video we will talk about the iOS 14.3 beta 1 on iPhone 11 Pro Max so without wasting any more time let's get right into today's video shall we so it's officially been quite a while where, what, when I have been using uh, the iOS 14.3 beta 1 on my device and uh, my experience have been actually really dope on this device I this uh, everything like uh, optimization to everything on this device is almost perfect of course i can't say that it is as as good as uh, official version but it is quite like quite similar to official version which is really really dope because it is beta 1 and we are still the stability and bugs uh, I, I haven't seen any bugs and the stability is so good on beta 1 and yeah it is really impressive Talking about the battery usage, I got around six and a half to eight hours of usage. Yeah, and that was an intensive usage. Six and a half to eight hours of intensive usage on beta one, and that's seriously mad. As I said on my like official versions, I use fourteen point two, I use fourteen point one. I was getting around seven and a half hours to eight and a half hours of usage, and that was also intensive usage. And on this device with beta one, I use fourteen point three the uh, i'm using it as an intensive user and i'm getting like more than six and a half to seven and a half hours of usage and that's really great for beta one everything is going really great for beta one and if you are planning on upgrading your device to i use 14.3 beta one then i would say yeah i usually do not recommend people to update the two betas to your uh, on your primary device but if it even it is your primary device and you just want to have some look at this firmware i would say go for it you can use it for some time like uh, one or uh, one week when the beta 2 will arrive i will be making another review on ios 14.3 beta 2 on iphone 11 pro max so be sure to subscribe and turn on notification i have planned a lot of videos in future all right so now is the main part now it is the series part what scores i will give it on like all around uh, how many scores i will give to this firmware on iphone 11 pro max so uh, on performance out of 10 i will give it uh, a solid 8.5 out of 10 and battery performance out of 10 i will give it around uh, 8 out of 10 because battery performance is really great too and uh, talking about the uh, stability i would give it a solid 9 0.5 out of 10 which is really really great actually i gave i use 14.2 beta beta 3 yeah beta 3 i gave i use 14.3 uh 2 beta 3 uh the score of 7 in terms of stability because it was actually to be honest it was not at all stable don't mind but it was not at all stable for those developers and uh, it was really hard time so it was not at all stable and looking to the this swarm where i use 14.3 beta 1 like it's just madness this is just so stable and so good software so if this video was helpful for you all be sure to give it a big old thumbs up and subscribe to this channel because i do these type of things almost daily and i will be covering a lot about this device and a lot of iphones so be sure to subscribe and turn on notification peace out and your boy will meet you in the very next episode